guys. Episode well, 10. Welcome to the fucking food review. Yeah, season finale. It's been um, really difficult, you know. It's hard work. It's sort of working out on my part because of all the extensive eating. Um, and uh, yeah, welcome to the fucking food review. Yeah, this is going to be the last episode for a while. Enough for us to collect our thoughts. Yeah, so for me to lose some weight. Hopefully. Yeah. Um, and it's great because we're packing it full, packing me full of mellows. And people have actually been calling me mellow lately. So give us some feedback. Let us know how you liked the first season. Yeah. What we can do better, what we could change, if we should move faster, stop talking as much, do whatever. Yeah. Or if you want, you know, better hosts. Yeah. You're not going to get that. So don't really, you know. Don't, don't ask for don't that. Don't ask for that, preferably. Um, but, uh, you know, we really want to want to know what you guys think. Okay, so, so today we have Smashmallow. Yeah. So, I mean, marshmallows really haven't changed for 100 years or so. Yeah. Somebody asked me the other day, they asked me if I could open up any restaurant, what would I open up? Uh, Schmore Beer. Be a beer place and you'd get delicatessen s'mores. So if you want just golden brown, you know, we'd have the perfect golden brown chard, obviously, steak, maybe, with wow. the marshmallow, but s'more beer. So well, this is perfect. Well, Smashmallow didn't go that extreme, but they, <laughs> but they did take marshmallows to the next level, which is really cool. So they're a lot bigger than I thought. Just looking at uh, uh, you guys can't see this, but on the back there's like little glimp, little hole glimpses. Yeah, well, we can show them because you're going to be trying them. But yeah, yeah. Today we have root beer, we have cinnamon churro, and we have espresso bean. Okay. And uh, these are really awesome because it, it's it's like a dessert turn on marshmallows with all natural ingredients, so, mm -hmm. it, so it's clean, and if you look at the ingredients on a normal marshmallow, it's still pretty limited, but um, it could be cleaner. I didn't even know there was ingredients in marshmallows. It's I pretty much just air and just sugar. just existed. Yeah. So let's, you wanna open that one just to show them what they look like? Yeah, I've been working out, so. I'm sunburned, I got really sunburned today, I was, I was on a bike ride. Yeah, I thought you always looked like this. See, look, it almost looks like a little tofu ball, but with cinnamon sugar on top. But not as sucky. I'm not a tofu fan. I gotta admit, it sucks. You're like tofu. you're like a little tofu ball. Yeah, it's great. I've been, you know, people call me roly poly oly sometimes. You know, honestly, sometimes sometimes late at night I just cry myself to sleep, stuffing my mouth full. So, oh, okay. we're doing two. You're you're doing one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But a few these, fun facts. These really smell. Yeah. So these are. <laughs> These are 80 calories a serving, okay. and you can actually like, bring these to a party. You can put them on in a platter. You could, you could juggle them. You could, you could lay in a bed of of smash mellows. Yeah, with for just enough money. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. They have seven creative flavors. So they have these three. They have like um, uh, mint chocolate chip, and then they have um, a lime flavor. I can't remember the rest. There's but. actually an underground marshmallow thing going on currently. I don't know if you've heard of it. Yeah, it's a big deal. It's called Mellow, Mellow My Yellow. Okay. It's a group. Danger, not too dangerous if you know how to get in. I haven't gone through all the trials and tribulations yet, but um, I'm excited to try this because this is, this is, I'm thinking of bringing this to my party. All right, let's try it. Which one? Okay, let's, let's start with root beer and go that way. You know, you know I love root beer, right? Yeah. I had to give it up because I loved it so much. Yeah. My girlfriend thought I loved it more than her. Give it a rating. Let's get let, let's get through them. That's awesome. Let's These are a lot better than I thought. When you first told me marshmallows, I'm used to the little shitty ones they put in coffee yeah. that melt before you can eat them. Yeah. This is awesome. I can't say it tastes exactly about like root beer. I mean, it tastes close, but it's great. I think it's pretty close. It's uh, they're all gluten free. They're all dairy free. So I want to get this on a campfire. To be honest, These you know what? I don't know how it would work. That would be really good. They're really good, guys. These are really good. I mean, okay. marshmallow wise, that's a ten. That's. that's I mean, solid. yeah, it's my it's root beer and marshmallow. Okay, Come churro. On. That's fantastic. That's really good. Wow. No switch right now. You can have mine. <laughs> okay. Well, what is that out of ten? Is that as good as the root beer? That might be it. Like it. I'm gonna make a, a uh, higher no, on the no, scale. No. I might be like eleven. <laughs> okay. Mm. Could you imagine death by marshmallow? So that's my least favorite. <laughs> what, are you gonna <laughs> you gonna wash it down with a churro? 
<laughs> no, but do me a favor. I just want to see. I want everyone to know the consistency. So I think it's really appropriate um, to finish the season off with uh, you actually sticking your finger in that marshmallow and telling showing everyone how it feels. And you know, I've used most of them. But yeah, but go right through the middle so they can see. No, no, no. Like down on the top. Okay. Oh, I like how you tell me how to finger. Oh, that is an impressive finger there. Can you pick it up with your finger? Wow. See, that just shows no, the creaminess. No strings. And you know no the strings. adaptability of these marshmallows. You can eat them. Completely adaptable. You can adapted. finger them. You could even put a uh, toothpick through them. If you, if, you don't want, if you don't want to scruff up your floor, yeah. put these on e each one of your furnitures and you can eat them later. Exactly. Yeah. Uh, there's, a, there's a couple of competitors in the market. The only one that's worth... Um, I was talking actually about. afraid for a second. <laughs> the only one that's worth talking about is dandies, and those are vegan. So if you're looking for a vegan option, these aren't vegan, these have gelatin. But if you're looking for a vegan option, go online, look at dandies. But this is Smash Mouth. You'll find them in Sprouts. Best place is to go to the website, Smash Mallow. I just said Smash Mouth. Smash Mallow. Smash .com, and you can order them. But you have to get six. Somebody wants... Oh, that might be copyright if I start going. That, yeah, that's true. Okay, so the rating on the in last one. In one of these, I put ecstasy. Wait, wait, which one? Wait, on on the espresso. What, what was your rating? Uh, I mean, I I don't know. I'm not really. I love coffee, but I give it like um. It's still a marshmallow. I give it like a seven. Yeah. You know, it's just not something you don't put those two together. Maybe in your coffee. I mean, might yeah, be you're right. I guess technically, but I think hot chocolate. They should have done hot chocolate. That would I make more like sense. They do. They have other flavors. They have four other flavors. So let's not. But you ate those already, or you made your bed out of them. They're for later. They're for later. <laughs> okay. No, I'm joking. I really don't have the other four. Keep I'll it safe. Keep it secret. Exactly. So this is the end of the season. Let yeah. us know other types of items that you want to see. Yeah. If there's any others, we'd love to actually hear your thoughts on on. You know, we've just been kind of picking our yeah. shelves. Well, but we want to know your thoughts. And so. we have lots of other samples. We've just been trying to pick good ones. So. Yeah. Um. Especially very fatty ones. So. Awesome. Well, until next season, guys, this is the fucking food review. I'm Thank Zach. Thank you for joining us. I'm Lonnie. And we'll see you next time.